Now that your newborn HAL Total Mobile Solution Simulator is ready for use, let us take a tour of his many features, such as a realistic airway, breathing, palpable pulses, bilateral IV arms, and catheterizable umbilicus. Newborn HAL can be intubated orally using an endotracheal tube if ventilations are required, and nasally if a nasogastric tube has been inserted. Once intubated, sensors detect the depth of the intubating tube. Should the tube be inserted too deep, the left lung is automatically disabled, realistically demonstrating right mainstem intubation. Correcting the tube position enables the left lung. Additionally, newborn HAL can be ventilated with a BVM or a mechanical ventilator. Ventilation and manual chest compressions are measured and logged showing the instructor exactly how students are performing. Newborn Hal has several upper airway sounds synchronized with his breathing, such as normal breathing, grunting, or crying. <coughs> Users can easily control rate and depth of respiration and choose independent left and right lung sounds, which are synchronized with selectable breathing patterns multiple sounds are available. <coughs> Newborn HAL is equipped with several realistic heart sounds which are tied to a user-defined heart rate and selectable rhythms. Newborn HAL's conductive skin sites allow the attachment of real electrodes. This feature permits the user to track cardiac rhythms and events with their own equipment, just like with a human patient. Newborn HAL's palpable pulses are dependent on blood pressure. The following pulses are available. Fontanelle, brachial, and umbilical. Users can also disable distal pulses. Programmable blood pressure can be read using a sphygmomanometer and users can auscultate the Korotkoff sounds. Newborn HAL has bilateral IV training arms that could be used for bolus or intravenous infusions, as well as for drawing fluids. In addition, he has IM sites on both his deltoids and quadriceps. The cyanosis feature allows the user to control the pallor of the newborn HAL skin when hypoxic events occur. Newborn HAL is outfitted with a muscle tone mechanism that can be used in conjunction with scenarios. Each arm can be set to move individually or set to represent a newborn with limp muscle tone, reduced muscle tone, active muscle tone, or convulsion. The lower right leg has an intraosseous injection site with replaceable tibia bones. Newborn HAL can be catheterized via exchangeable male and female genitalia. For additional realism, virtual vital sign monitors are available in both fixed and mobile formats. <laughs> 